Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek Grid. I am Penge and welcome back to Ostriv. And here is our little settlement and it's looking very lovely. We've got a couple of farms now. We've got a few houses, we've got a few houses, we need some more, a little trading post and more excitingly we've got cows. There's actual cows, look there's cows right there which is jolly exciting. We've got how many cows? That many cows. Uh, it doesn't really tell me how many I've got. Nine! Nine cows! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one above that, eight and nine, nine cows. That's very exciting. Now I'm assuming, I'm assuming given that they're, you know, there's two bulls and the rest are, are oxes, I assume that they'll breed. I'm going to guess that they're going to do some breeding and produce baby cows, I would guess. I don't really know. So anyway, so today's agenda, I think, is to work work the cattle angle i think we need to work that because there are things in here that help with this so we got a slaughterhouse to make meat and hides a tannery to produce leather from the hides and then presumably after that we could get you know tailors and weavers and shoemakers shoemaker for the tannery so that might be quite cool that could work well also an oil workshop we do have sunflowers we've got sunflowers in there 3.95 units of sunflowers but we're not really doing anything with them so I don't quite know what to do with them apart from make oil and then presumably we sell the oil. So there's quite a lot to do. There's, there's, yeah, there's various bits and bobs that I want to do. In fact, the first thing we are going to do is build that sunflower, whatever it was, the oil refinery type thing. Now I did look, just before I started uh, recording, I did look here, I thought, ah, what we need is we need another forestry place to, uh, to get some more wood. But no, we don't. It, there's 206 wood and they basically can't do any more. It says all work is done, nothing to do now because they've maxed out their firewood They've maxed out the wood. They've maxed out the logs. So there literally is nothing for those guys to do. So they have done their job admirably. Good job, sirs. What we do need, we are going to build ourselves an oil workshop. Here we go. Here we go. Oil workshop. Let's pop that then. Let's pop that there, shall we? Can we put that that way? Behind there. Near the... Oh, no. Let's put it there, actually. Let's put it... Oh, do we want a road going behind there, though? Yeah, let's put it there. And we can have a street. We can have some houses going off that way is the plan right how oh i pressed that oh, i pressed the entire wrong button i pressed the wrong button i'm such an idiot uh there oil workshop e a tiny tilt it no not that way like that maybe so we can have a road yeah there so let's pop that there splendid and then i want some houses so we're gonna have a house facing that way like that uh, see, it says place is occupied. <laughs> You're supposed to be snapping to the edge. There, look. That'll do. So a house just there, and then another house next to that one facing the same way. So kind of like... Uh, God, where's the where's the roadway going? Like that. There we go. So we've got that thing, so the oil workshop, and a couple of houses. And then I'm going to drop another house, just not facing that way. Another house just there because we do need more houses. So here it says there's jobs available, but there's no housing. So people aren't going to come in. We're not going to sort of get the people coming in and visiting us and joining our settlement because there's simply no houses available, which is not very good. Now, are the, are the crops growing here at all? I am kind of messed up the crop growing thing here. I forgot. <laughs> I kind of forgot to uh, set the fields to active. So I told them what I wanted in the fields, but then I didn't actually tell anyone to go and plant some stuff because I am stupid. So uh, yeah, we'll have to hope that hope that that grows something. Otherwise, uh, yeah, food is going to be scarce. Messenger from Marifa is visiting now. <gasps> visiting for twenty five more days. Offers hemp and wheat. Demands sunflower oil and sunflower. Oh, we could give them one sunflower. Uh, about three. Oh no, two. Let's do two sunflowers because then we can make oil out of that. After the rest of it. Let's give them that actually. One sunflower. There we go. Let's do some dealing. That's good. And uh, wheat. Let's buy, yeah, and then let's buy some wheat. So let's spend that mythical money that we're getting. I'm assuming that this number is some sort of money. Although I don't know where else to check how much money I've got. There appears to be no sort of indicator as to where that is. Now, I don't think this has been upgraded since I last played. No, there's just some nice trees and things and benches and stuff. Oh, yeah, actually, do you know what? Can we drop a couple more benches down? That might be quite a nice thing to have. Yeah, so there, look. I quite like the fact that there's a bench. Let's turn it around so people can... Oh, no, 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 it was the right way around. Let's turn it so it's like that. And people can have a little sit down. 
on a bench, which magically just appears without any kind of material requirements. There we go. Look, and people can sit down and have a rest. Or, yeah, like that. Lovely. So people can sit down. Not a lot of building work going on here, fellas. Looking for labourers. There must be loads of people out there. Loads and loads of people available to come and do stuff. Well, you guys don't need to be doing anything. So I can take you guys out because you've told me that there's nothing that needs to be done. So you two can sit there. You can come out of your place and you can go and do that. Right, you, we don't need anything carpentry based at the minute. So I don't know what, your is, what it is you're doing where it says working. I don't know what you're working on. You, thatch man, you've produced as much thatch as you can, so you can come out of there. Right, fishing guys, you're still cool. Yeah, you're good. We like you fishing guys. So hopefully, these guys should now be putting things on site. Yeah, there we go. Four labourers, splendid. We just need more people. We just need more people. So one oil workshop, three houses. Okay, and then over here... Right, have we got any more cows yet? Have we got baby cows? Baby cows? No, still nine cows. Okay, fine. Uh, over here, we want to have the bit with the cow, so we're going to you know, do some some work on this. I want another two more of those little thingamabobs. I think they're in there, are they? No, where are they? The hay collector things, hay dryers. So let's put them, two of those. So let's get one, let's twist it round. Whee! There we go, like that. And uh, I forgot to do the shift click thingy. And another one just there. Splendid. Oh, look, did someone just run over and put some stuff in? Yeah, look, they're gathering grass and they're putting on it right now. Well done. Well done, you lovely people. Hey, there you go. Loading it up with grass and then it can become hay like that. Splendid. Right, we might need a couple more of those. Maybe we need a couple more of those storage things. Oh, hay barracks. Hey, barracks. Let's drop another one there. And then let's drop another one uh, there. Because these don't appear to take any resources. It's a bit mysterious. One there, and then another one there. Because they don't seem to require any kind of resource to build, so that's good. Um, I've got all that stuff going on. Cart, parking, we've got plenty of. Now, yeah, I, there was a comment last time that said I hadn't opened all these up. I thought I had opened some of them up. Yeah, they've got people in, they've got people in. Oh, I'm not actually supplying anything, though. All right, potatoes, you can supply... Oh, uh, we haven't really got anything else. We haven't got, like, milk and stuff. Actually, do we not get milk from these cows? How does this work? Milk. We've got milk. Is milk going into the thing? Is milk going into the granary? Yes, milk. Okay, you, you can sell milk. We've actually got milk. That's tremendous. That's very exciting. Okay, so now there, there's still nine of them. There's still nine. Okay. Okay, fine. I don't I don't quite know how that works. And resource supply, whatever. But labor by car, labor by hands, whatever. Just get stuff there if you need it. Okay. So that's the bit where they you know the the hay is all sort of mounting up and they've got hay storage for the cows. That's good. Over here then. Can we put it there, do you reckon? No, it's not a very accessible place. What about here? Let's get ourselves a slaughterhouse. <laughs> oh, it's just mean, isn't it? Okay, now let's put the slaughterhouse up there. Uh, in fact, yeah, can we have it here? Like that, look. So have the slaughterhouse there, and then the tannery could go next to it. That would make sense, wouldn't it? So we'll have the slaughterhouse there. I'm very sorry, cows. Sorry, cows, but this is the 18th century, and that's kind of important. So a slaughterhouse, and then a tannery can go next to it. Now, where's the front of the tannery? It's... It, I don't know where the front of the tannery is. It's oh it's it's kind of there. Okay, that's fine. So we want to put that kind of there, I would say, like that. So we've got a tannery and a slaughterhouse. How lovely. Okay, so we've got a big queue of things. Oh now the, the seed place is finished, this place. So let's pop a worker into there and see what happens. Meanwhile, everyone else can get building these houses because the more houses we have, the more people we can bring in, which is more workers, and more labourers and all that kind of stuff, which is jolly good. Ah, good. They're absolutely flying through doing this house. This is good. There you go. Construction in progress. And they're able to build it all because there's loads and loads of resources in there. Six, five, four, three. They're doing lots of work. Good job. Good job. That house is nearly done. Uh, okay, you're making nails. That's good. Iron 4.78. The camp centre is gone. Ah, the camp storage, the little storage thing is gone because presumably we've moved the iron into there. So all we've got left is the camp centre just there. Uh, can we 
take apart this thing? Campfire. Well, let's demolish the campfire. We don't need that. Bench. We don't need that either. Let's demolish the old camp stuff. There we go. The well can stay there for now until we've replaced the camp centre with a town hall. And I am going to do that. Now, I'd quite like the town hall to be kind of here in the middle or maybe here, maybe next to the trading post. That would look quite cool, wouldn't it? Uh, and then the mayor, the mayor, goes into the town hall, I guess, and sits there for a bit. Okay, so this is good. This is good. It's all going well. They've still got their... Yeah, right. Okay, now we do need some back doing some work there now because we're going to run out of wood again. It's going to go, oh, you've run out of wood because we've used 100 wood. I'm presumably like, building all these buildings and getting stuff sorted. Ah, look, you're getting on with it. You're getting on with it. This is good. You're going to get to the clay bit as well. That's good. So a bit of a fireplace, bit of the walls going in. Yep, some more walls going in, some more timber. This is very good. Construction in progress. Right, now they've run out of stuff. So they need some clay to go in. Come on, we just need another house and we'll get some more labourers done. Oh, that house is being built as well. Oh, that's quite good. So they're working on all sorts of different things. Splendiferous. Okay. Oh, look, there is something coming from these fields. It might not be very much, but it's some potatoes and stuff. So that's good. Uh, okay. Yeah, now see, again, I want more cows so I can have plows. I can make cows into plows. So that'll be quite cool as well. So um, what, what was that in that field? That was wheat. That was wheat. Ah, so the hemp. Right, okay. So we need to sort the farm out. So let's slow time down. This farm is done. So three fallow fields. They're all back to normal. That field has got no nutrients in whatsoever. Let's leave that fallow. And then next time out... We can have that as, say, uh, can't change crop during its season. Oh, okay, fine. Okay, yep. So it's it's still thinking it's in. So even though they've obviously took everything out of it, it's still saying, no, no, it's still farming season. Okay, that's fine. Cool, man. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, have they finished building that house? Oh, they've so nearly finished building the house. They're so nearly finished building the house. Come on. A bit of clay, a bit of wood. And you shall be finished. And then another family will probably move in. We'll have to check how quickly it is until they move in. Come on. Let's get that. So that's the problem. Migration status. No housing available. That is the problem. Come on. A bit of clay. There's a clay pit just there. I put it there for that very reason. Yeah. All right. You've got the wood in there. Get the clay in. There we go. Right. Construction is happening. Yeah. I think this is it. That'll be enough, won't it, to finish it off? Four, three, two, one... Ah, oh, goodness me. Does it need one more bit of wood? I oh, know the wood's done. It's thatch. Okay, so it needs thatch. Now, he should have a lot of thatch in there. 20, indeed. 20 thatch in the uh, in the place. So it should be all right in the thatchery. So it should be okay. We just need someone to bring the thatch over here. Anytime you like, fellas. Anytime you like. Hello. Can you do it quicker, please? Ah, there we go. Right. Is that, that's There we go. Three thatch. Could you not have just stay to finish it as well, Mr. Delivery Man? <laughs> come on. Right, you. You're going to do it. You're going to... Anyone. Could someone come and finish this flipping house? It's nearly there. It just needs a roof. Come on. What if it rains? Go in and it'll all be muddy under the bottom. On the bottom of the house, it'll all be muddy. Right, you. You're going to finish this house for me. Yes. Yes. And yes, at 52, immediately up to 55. So presumably people have instantly moved in. Okay, right. So yeah, so houses are... An instant draw for someone to come in. Yeah, there they are already. Look, wow. Poise. They must have been poised just on the outside and waiting. Right, so there's no housing available. Okay. We're building another house. And there's another house scheduled as well. Just there, look, next to that one. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's build some more houses. If that's what they want, if that's what the people want, that's what we shall give them. Right, let's build some houses along here. Uh, if we can get it sort of straight, kind of like that that oh it's not very level there perfect we'll have that and we'll have another house is that where the front is yeah another house like that there we go so two more houses so four houses planned and the slaughterhouse and the tannery and that's good because these people in this house shouldn't have any jobs they should go and become workers which is jolly exciting can i change the farm yet does it still count as season Yep, still during the season, allegedly. Okay, so now they're working on that house. So what else do we need? So we've got that and that in. Ah, is someone doing something here? Is someone working this? Ah, oh, there we go, look. He's, he's making sunflower oil. We've got five stored. Ah, resource supply. So we need to 
Uh, we need to take it away. Labourer by cart. We need someone to take away that sunflower oil because he can't store any more. He's got five created and five stored. Okay. So is someone going to come and take that sunflower oil away? Yes, there. There, you. You have taken it away. Uh, oh, no. Did you bring some sunflowers in? Oh, I thought you took it away. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, so can we sell sunflower oil now? Is that a is that a particularly sellable resource? There's somebody there. Let's slow time down. Uh, no, they want wheat and shoes, weird enough. Okay, fine. Uh, they want to send a messenger. Oh, and that's send a messenger. Now, this number here, I don't know what this is. 90. So send messenger 90. Send messenger 30. And then, you know, we're buying stuff for 10 and 20. I don't... I don't, where do I find out what that number is? Where is that number? That magic number? Maybe I need to build this. Unlocks more ways to control your town. Maybe I just need the town hall in place in order to actually get on with stuff. To get a different set of options or something? I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, I think the town hall would go quite well. Just there. <laughs> I need to remove a tree. That's absolutely fine. But I think it would be quite cool just there. Look at the end of that bit. There's a little area there where there's all the workshops and stuff going on. Should we put it there? Or should we put it on a roadside somewhere? Uh, where should we put the town hall? It does fit quite stupidly just there, but that's a terrible place for it. Or should we put it just here? Look, the town hall can go next to the trade place. The place is occupied. The terrain is uneven. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, I can't put it there. Uneven terrain. Oh, never mind. Never mind. The terrain is too wibbly wobbly. Okay, let's put it here. Let's just put the town hall just there next to those houses and let's see if that gives us a, a steer on what this sort of mysterious value of this thing is that these things are this money that i'm spending uh okay that's cool right can we put some trees around that a few trees where are the trees decoration a birch tree oh look it starts off as a little tree that's lovely there we go and a cottonwood tree uh possibly just there and another tree an ash tree there there we go. That'll look nice. We'll decorate it a little bit. So around the edge of our town hall. Do you know what? Let's have another one as well. What else have we got? A pine. Let's pop a pine out the front as well. There we go. So it'll look lovely and they will grow and it should be marvellous. Uh, okay. Let's speed time on. Let's get time going quick. There's loads to build and, and everyone's very slow at doing it. Come on. Build quicker, please. Can I change that yet? Ah, right. I can. So are all the fields there sorted? Pretty much aren't they of that farm oh no they're all the fallow ones there we go that's it i can't change crop during its season it, it, really can i unactive i can't deactivate during season okay but that one i can change that's a bit confusing okay fine so i still can't change the crop thing okay never mind uh it's just it's just a case of waiting now then we need them to finish this house which would be good if they could do it soon, because then that would bring another family in, and that family can be labourers and go and do some work. It's going to start being all snowy soon. So they've gone back into the cow shed. Okay, one is two years old. Now, do I want... Yeah, so they're eating the hay, but that's fine. There's loads of hay stored, so that's fine. And the cows will survive through the winter, I'm fairly certain, because there's loads of hay in the hay storage thing over here. There's loads of hay on the little sort of hay dryer collector things. So they should be fine. Those guys will be fine. What I need to do, following on from that, do I want to go and get some more cows? Do I want some more cows? What's the what's the limit? What's the limit? Livestock limit, 20. Do I want to build another cow shed? I could just load that cow shed up, couldn't I, with 20, 20 things? Or do I have another cow shed? I quite like the idea of another cow shed. Kind of going along the other side. Do you know what? That's what we're going to have. For no real reason. I just like the idea that there's two. There we go. So another cow shed can sit just there. And that can come out here and have its field thing there. That's very cool. Okay. There's a lot of waiting. We've got a massive building queue now for five, six, eight things. Eight things we want built. Come on, everybody. Chop, chop. Uh, okay. This is a great time for me. Oh, oh, oh. Hang on. Could they finish this house? The clay is in. The nails are there. So he's loading the clay in. Right, that's all the clay that's going to need, surely. How are we doing for wood? How are we doing for wood, fellas? 224 wood. You guys are absolutely on fire. Good job, sirs. Uh, okay, yep. So we just need some wood down here then. For you. And then... 
that house will be finished. We'll hopefully get some more people in and then we can crack on with the rest of it. That other house is nearly done as well. There's another house that's coming along very well. Out oh, there. <gasps> oh, and it's December, which must mean snow. Obligatory snow in December, even though it doesn't really snow in December anymore. But never mind. Well, it doesn't here in the UK anyway. Whilst we wait for all these things to be built, I think I should possibly just clarify something that happened last time out. So last time out, I gave this place a name. I did christen our settlement and I christened it Kilton Means. Now, for most people in the UK, they will get that kind of terrible, it's not really a joke, but the, the reference, they'll get the reference. They'll get the Kilton Means reference. Other people around the world probably went, what, what, what does Kilton Means mean? I don't, I don't understand. You're speaking nonsense, good sir. So I should possibly explain. So in the UK, possibly in the 70s, I guess, um, there was a new town built from scratch. There was nothing and they built a whole town up out of nothing and it was called Milton Keynes. So this is a new settlement. Obviously, it's a new town. So I thought, yep, yeah, let's call it Kilton Means because why the heck not? Uh, there is a messenger coming uh, selling salt, lime and dried food. Oh, we could buy some lime. That might be quite nice. Let's buy... Two lime. The only thing is, I'd a three lime. I don't know how much I've got. I don't know how much of this thing there is. I really don't know. Okay, a deal. Let's let's have three lime for whatever money that is. Uh, yeah, that's the only thing I don't know. So hopefully, building our town hall will help kind of stop those weird things coming up where I don't. I just don't know what it is. I don't know what I'm paying. Like, it, do I need to pay more money? Like each of these has a little wealth value, thirty two and. Five, oh, they're particularly poor, and 12, and 23, and 20, and all that kind of stuff. But I don't know what it... 85? Those guys are loaded. The Tur Hubs are absolutely loaded. Good job, Tur Hubs. Um, yes, yeah, so I don't really know what it means. I don't know what they mean. Is this house going to be finished? Is the thatch there? Yes. Yes. Yay! And immediately someone's moved in. Already, look, another family have come in. That is very good news. Very good news. Okay. Okay. Um, can we have another person on the farm? Because there are all ladies working on the farm. So why not just open it up? There we go. And that gives some people some more jobs and presumably some more monies and stuff. I don't know. Right. They have come straight in. We're going to get another house done in a second. Looking for some labourers. Literally, they need some thatch. That's all they need. That is the only, the final bit is three thatch. Now, have we got enough thatch? Yeah, there's 11. Okay. Let's pop someone in there just to make some more. Very briefly. And then, yeah, we just need all this stuff now. So like the slaughterhouse and the that thing, the tannery, these things need all the things on site. So they're bringing the wood and the nails. Well, the wood's only coming from there. They could walk it. You could literally walk it over. These buildings here should be fairly quick to build, I would have thought. Once the resources are in, another house, 64. This is very encouraging. Okay, I like this. This is good. It's going well. Right, Mr. Sunflower Oil. Is the sunflower oil going into it? 12 sunflower oil. Okay, okay. Does anybody want sunflower oil? This place. Uh, do they want sunflower oil? Oh, no. Ah, right. Okay, my messengers have all gone. Okay, that's fine. Well, let's send a messenger to just there. See if they want sunflower oil. There we go. Let's watch them on the magic yellow horse. Clip clop. Gallop. Gallop quicker, good sir. Gallop quicker. Okay, you're going to take a little while. That's absolutely fine. So they're working on the slaughterhouse. The tannery is looking for labourers. There should be plenty of labourers, I would have thought. Plenty of labourers. Like you, look, you're both unemployed. Surely unemployed means you go and be a labourer, doesn't it? Do not know what that means? Hiring. Yeah, you sort of, you can hire the labourers. Messenger arrived. Um, uh, offers. Oh no, we don't offer them cows. They're demanding potatoes. How many potatoes have we got? Lots. Okay, you can have two potatoes. Two potato units for that much money. That's that's what it is. Oh yeah, and they're offering. Oh no, they're offering cows. Oh, we could. Oh, they're offering iron. Actually, how much iron have we got in there? Three point eight four. Okay. Yeah, maybe we buy a an iron. Just one iron for twelve, whatever it is, to make some more nails because we're going to run out of that. That's that is a good point. Um, and cows. Now, can we split? Once that's built, can we split those cows up? Drag and drop on other cow shed to relocate. Okay, so we can get ourselves some more cows. I think. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. Um, I think we get ourselves some more cows. I think we get ourselves. Uh, there's nine in there with a capacity of twenty. So let's get another 
six of those, another two of those, that's eight. Let's get another one of those and we'll turn one of them into a, a, a thing, an ox, whatever it is, to plough the fields. So that's another nine. A hundred. Yeah, okay, fine. I don't know how much money I've got, so that'll do. That seems like a fun thing. Uh, okay, yeah, good. Cash is done. But they're spending a lot of time building the houses still, aren't they? Come on, come on. Build the houses quicker. Another thing we can do is down here, actually, as well, while I was thinking about it, uh, is pop a well. Where's a well? Water, there. Let's pop a well down here whilst we're here, because there isn't a well down this end of the village. So let's just pop a little well just there. Splendid. Just, you know, it doesn't think it costs much to build a well. A bit of wood and some nails. There you go. A wooden well? Sure, they're made of stone. Anyway, whatever the case, uh, they're getting on with stuff now. So the slaughterhouse is being done. The village house. Which one's that? Ah, there, next to the windmill and opposite the farms. That's quite a picturesque one, I would have thought. Okay, right. The, these fields, I can do these now. Yay! Right, let's have uh, potatoes in that one. Let's have sunflowers in that one. Let's have uh, wheat in that one. And let's have... Uh, wheat in the uh, hemp, hemp, because we're going to build a clothing thing soon. Let's have hemp in that one, and they're all active. That's good, right? That is, uh, yeah, what do you want for these fields? That one is okay. So, that field potatoes is absolutely fine. Yeah, I'm with you on that. Potatoes that will not be able to cope with sunflowers, that might be able to cope with wheat. What does wheat need? 50%, 60%, and nothing. No, no, not quite. It can't cope. That can cope. 50% 60. Yes, that can stay as wheat. That can stay as wheat. But that can't. So let's leave that one as fallow. Or is that hemp? Have we got enough for that? For that one? Needs 84%. What does hemp need? 69%. Yeah, okay, there we go. So our fields have got all lots of stuff in. They're all active. That's good. When the other cows are up, well, here they are. They're here now. Yay, lots of cows. Uh, okay, lots and lots of them, it seems. Okay, that's good. So current 19, the, the, the limit is 20. Okay, so let's turn that bull of two years, now is this going to go wrong, into an ox. Okay, what's that done now then? So how do I... Ah! Is, is, well, so it just turns it into one of these. Did I just make a stupid mistake there by turning it into an ox? Ox of two years. Oh, I don't really understand what that was. Oh, but the snow's melting. Hurrah. So if I now go to the farm, say order a plough. A plough has been ordered, so then he needs to go into there. Can I order a plough for this farm as well? Order another plough. That's oh, so an ox is just a a, a, a not bull. <laughs> is that what that is? There's a cow there. What's the difference between a cow and an ox and a bull? I don't, why are there three types? I don't fully understand that, if I'm completely honest. I don't understand the difference between cow, an ox, and a bull. But there's a cow. So does that mean it's new? Does that mean it's a, ba a baby one? I don't flip in, no. But at least you, Mr. Man, can get on with building a plough. And that's very exciting. So hopefully, maybe it won't be ready. Ah, right, you're visiting. Demands potato. Offers iron. Yeah, we'll have an iron. And we'll sell you two lots of potatoes. There you go. Good job. You don't need to offer me flour, though. Oh, I've got loads of that. got loads of flour. I'm good at flour. I'm pretty much efficient at flour. Okay, these guys. Yeah, you. So I kind of want to see you get on with this. So two out of two animals. He's very quick, isn't he? Bang, 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 bang. I wish that was how you built stuff. Just stand in front of it in one place and just wiggle a hammer around and things magically appear. Here we go. And he's taking it to the farm. Yes, this is very cool. This is very exciting. There you go. They've got a plow. You've got a plow. You can now plow fields and things. <sighs> but I've kind of missed the plowing bit because I've already sown the seeds. But next year, next year, you shall have a plow, my good sirs. And that should be very exciting. Uh, okay, the slaughterhouse is new, as is the village house. Right, you uh, are... Ah, you're waiting to build this other one. Okay, naught out of two animals. Oh, Oh, oh no, the animals are being bought in. There you go. Another one coming in. And it's sitting there. And then this person's going to bring the other one over. I assume. Yep, there's another one. Splendid. Okay. What's going on in here then? So now there are... What was that? That was been a house. Oh, that was that house. Okay, and there's already people moving in. This is beautiful. Okay, can we finish the slaughterhouse, please? You've been... It's been an awfully long time since we started work on this. 
Uh, looking for labourers. Come on. Come on. What are people all doing? Get on with it. Right, you. We've got a thousand nails. We don't need any more nails. You guys are doing very well at wood. That's good. We need a lot of wood to support all these things. But Nail Man can go and have a lie down. <laughs> he can go and have a little rest. That's good. You guys can keep doing that. Right. He's... Oh. Oh, he's nearly finished building his cart, but he's decided to have a little rest. So once he's done, we'll take him out of the carpentry place and we'll drop him back into the, the workforce. Right, a labourer's dropped in the clay. So all the clay is in place. The wood is now needs to go in. And then that place should be pretty much done, I would have thought. So waiting a little bit more wood and that's it. So the slaughterhouse, once they get that wood, there you go. You should be able to finish the slaughterhouse now. That's quite exciting. Right, and then... Yeah, the wood's gone in, so the plough can be finished any day now when he turns up for work. Come on, it's been off for about the first two weeks of the month. Get on with it, man. Where is he? Please, someone come and finish something. Right, there's a worker. There's a worker on his way. Yes, this is good. Right, and you are finishing that plough. Splendid. Right, you can go back into the workforce. You can drop the plough off at the farm. Ta-da! Right, each farm has a plough. That's good news. This place is nearly finished. It just work. It's the final touches, look. So there's two workers on it. To, 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 hello, guys. Please finish something. Please go and finish it. Yes, that's it. Good job. Good job. You're putting the roof bits in. Does that not need thatch? Or has that got a wooden roof? Uh, okay, he's doing some stuff. He's doing some... Yeah, wooden roof. Okay, that's absolutely fine. <gasps> it's finished. A uh, long last. Right, and then that's the tannery next door. That's quite cool. Okay. Um, well, let's employ a worker for that place, the slaughterhouse. And when there's a worker in there, what we'll do is we shall go and kill ourselves a cow. It sounds very horrible, doesn't it? I'm going to go and press slaughter on a cow. Oh, it's not nice. But it gives us some meat. And meat's quite nice. That'll make people happy. Come on. I need to assign a worker to it. There's all these people, but there's people in these houses saying, I've got unemployed. They got unemployed. Uh, ah, she works at the cow shed. Trading post. Labourer construction. Yeah, oil workshop, trading post, farm. Yeah, look, father, unemployed. Go and work at the bloody slaughterhouse like I've asked you to do. <laughs> it's not difficult. Come on. Okay, this place is coming along quite well. That's good. There's a lot more wood going in. It's awaiting some more wood. But they are properly flying along with the tannery. That's good news. We're not going to be doing anything, though, if we don't get someone in the slaughterhouse to actually kill the cow in the first place. Sorry, cow. Uh, is that going to finish? Yeah, they're going to get to that red point today. Okay, yeah, so stop. So there's still no one there. There's no one doing anything in there. Come on. Uh, 16. Does that mean they've bred or not, then? I don't really know. Cow, one month. Yes. Oh, a little baby cow. Two months. Yes, yeah, so there is. There's a baby cow. That's very exciting. And it's a girl cow? Is that the girl symbol? Yes. So what's an ox then? Yeah, there was some chat about this in the messages. Was it an, like an ox is a a, a a castrated bull or something? Whereas a cow is a girl is a girl cow. Whereas an ox... But then I didn't order oxes, did I? Or did I just do... Did I do that really stupidly? I thought I ordered lots of cows and bulls, not a mixture of those. Right, hang on. Is there someone working there? There is. There's someone working there. Okay, an ox. Slaughter. Bye-bye. You're going to go and get slaughtered. I'm very sorry. This is this is me. Sorry, vegetarian people. Oh, and you're the unlucky one. You were nearest the gate at the time. Okay, and yeah, one hide and some beef. Oh, feel a bit mean. But the hides can go to the tannery. This is very cool. So the hides will go into the tannery and the tannery will turn it into leather and then, excitingly, once all this stuff's done, oh, and they've nearly finished a house. They've nearly finished a house. We just need some thatch. Is there any thatch left? Yes, there is. There's a worker on the thatch. That's lovely. Come on, finish this house. It's on the site. It's on site. Come on, we need a worker and you can finish building this house. And then the... What's that? The tannery is nearly done. Yeah, and then the town hall. I kind of wanted the town hall done as well. But no, okay, so you're getting this done. Yeah, they're dropping some stuff off at the town hall. That's fine. 200 nails. Good grief. Oh, there you go. That's all the nails on site, at least. And another house. 68 housing. 68 residents. Up to... Still 68 residents. Not enough food for sale. 
Okay, right, you, potatoes and beef, and you can have milk and flour, and you're selling fish and flour, and you're selling potatoes and fish and flour. So let's have you selling something else as well. What about sunflower oil? There we go. And hopefully, there's not enough food for sale. What do you mean there's not enough food for sale? There's plenty of food. Lots of food. 68. Yeah, there's still that house empty then. That's a shame. Oh, that's just irritating, isn't it? I kind of wanted that to be good and have some more people coming in. Um, have we got enough people fishing? We've got two people fishing, which should be enough. Yeah, so that's going back up. So that's good. That's a good thing. Yeah, we haven't got that much in the way of food. Though. You're absolutely right, haven't you? Right. Let's get rid of a couple of these. There's a couple of oxes that are two years. Families out of food. Okay. What do you want me to do about that? They could go and buy some, couldn't they? They could go and get some. Look in the granary. There's... Oh, God, there's no, there's no food. Ah, oh, okay. We could do with the, 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 the farm thing happening kind of now. That would be really useful. Uh, oh, hemp is growing very slowly. Okay. Family's out of food. Go and get some more. Get some more food, possibly. There's going to be beef in a minute. Look, there's beef. Lovely beef. Do you want some beef? Family that's out of food, have you got beef? Uh, because some places can sell beef now. You can sell beef. Uh, is there only one place selling the beef? Oh, this place can as well. Milk, flour and beef. There. You're awaiting some beef and you can sell it as well. There we go. Splendid. Okay, so now they should have, hopefully, some food. They've got a lot of money. They've got a lot of monies. Okay, are we running out of food? Is this the problem? Have we run out of food? No, there's some beef there and there's some milk as well. So that's fine. Uh, yeah, okay, good. So that's, that's, hopefully they'll be okay. Yeah, they've got some beef going in. Yeah, you can chew on beef, just dry it out, and gnaw on it. That's absolutely fine. Uh, okay, what I want to do is then, I want to get that finished. Now that's going to take a long time to get finished, isn't it? That's going to take ages to work on. Is the tannery done? The tannery is oh so nearly complete. I think it's got all the wood to be completed and all the nails. It needs possibly a bit of clay to go into it, and that's it. So I don't quite know what we're waiting for there. Uh, you guys can go back out. You guys can go back out into the into the workforce and help with the numbers to get stuff built because that'll be useful. You guys are very busy working on this, but now you keep running out of resources. So you need some more clay. There's a clay pit there. Go and get some dudes. Go and get some clay while you're there. Okay, this person is bringing some clay over. Drop that in. Might need more than one. Might need another three, please, if you would be so kind. So this person's loading it up. God, they need loads of clay. Okay, yeah, that's loads. I need another four. Here's another two coming in. This is good. Uh, oh, and is that the tannery complete? Yes, it is. Okay, that's cool. So we need to then do a worker to go and work in the tannery to create some leather. And then next time, what we'll do is we shall have... The, uh, what should we create then? A shoemaker's Workshop produces shoes from leather because shoes were requested from lots of the little trading things that we did. And then I want to create that. So then a Weaver's Workshop and then a Tailor's Workshop. We can make clothes and stuff as well. Oh, this is very exciting. It's very good. But I do need to sort out my food woes. So I don't want people to not have food. That's a bad thing. So we need lots of these. We need lots of potatoes and things. That does not look like it's doing anything at all. Is it growing anything? It just looks like normal grass. It just looks like grass. Okay, fine. Uh, that's wheat, wheat, that's potatoes and hemp. That's wheat. And there's sunflowers and a big field of potatoes as well. Okay, there'll be lots of food. So what we're going to do is, this is a good point to, to stop things now. When we come back, the focus will be on getting this town hall sorted. Now, it's going to looks like it's going to take a long time. It's going to take a lot of resources and faffing about to get that finished. So then we'll see when we start out next time, what that actually lets us do. Whether, you know, whether it lets us see the money value or set taxes or set food rationing, or I don't know, whatever. It does say there, unlocks more ways to control your town. So I don't quite know what that means. So we shall see. Oh, hang on. A visitor. A visitor from Marefa is offering hemp and wheat uh, and demanding sunflower. Oh, we could sell some sunflower oil. 
yeah, sell two lots of sunflower oil and we'll buy some wheat off you because we could do with some wheat right now because we're a bit hungry and we've not got much food. Sorry, everybody. Uh, okay, yeah, so what we'll do is, while this place this place is probably going to be finished very soon, in fact, yeah, so we're awaiting wood. So I would say next time we're going to see what this brings. So we're going to see what the town hall does. But we have done very well. They're doing the, they're getting the crops in. It's August. This is good. The harvest is happening. We've got cows. It's jolly exciting. Do you know what? Let's send another ox off to be slaughtered. There we go. I'm very sorry. Sorry, dudes. But that's good at least. Right. Okay. You've stored some leather. So we've got some leather made from the tannery as well. So it's all looking very, very cool. But next time out, there is still much, much to be done. And there's a family out of food. So it's all getting a bit tight for food. So hopefully this harvest should help. Oh, and that's finished. That's finished. Right. Okay. Pause. There's two families out of food now. <laughs> this is probably not a good thing. And that family is out of food. That one's not out of food anymore. Oh no, they are out of food. Which one? Which one's that one? Who are you? Oh, that house. You've got firewood and water, but nothing to eat. Okay. So hopefully now all the stuff coming in, all the harvested stuff, will help offset this silly food issue. So hopefully that'll be good. Maybe next time out we need to build another farm. I suspect another farm might be quite a useful thing to build. But yeah, there we go. There we go. We've done well. Hopefully we can sort the food thing out. If you've enjoyed this, please do leave a like and don't forget to subscribe too. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard and I will see you next time. Yes! In your face! In your face, hats. I didn't even know what was going on there. There was blood and rain and doom. Fall on my head, hat. I have no hat. <laughs> Rectify this matter, okay? Wrong. That was a car. It's happening again. Keep it together. Ah, oh, no!